Hello everyone, this is Truck Driver Lifestyles coming at you with another interesting video. Today I have me a 20 footer container um, with an odd looking item on the back here. Um, two items. This is going to a battery plant. Um, they're going to be making lithium batteries and things of that nature. So these are one of the pieces that they need that they ordered, uh, had brought in from Greece. And I'm at the dock. As you can see, they're getting everything started in here. They haven't gotten everything going just yet. They've been working on it. COVID kind of slowed everything up. Um, but I'm going to have to take this and go around the back with it. They're going to unload it with the extension forklift rather than the traditional forklift because of the way this is loaded. As you can see, it's sitting on two pallets. There's another pallet here and a pallet there. And then, of course, they got it strapped down here to keep it from moving. And the last one back there, they don't have it strapped in at all. Well, they got it strapped in at the top, not at the bottom. But they still got it sitting on two um, pallets at the bottom in order to be able to get this product to come off with a forklift. That's what the hopes are doing it when I go around the back. So instead of opening, unloading it, excuse me, unloading it from or with a forklift, traditional forklift and a dock they're gonna open, unload it out in the open so stay tuned and we'll be coming back with that footage welcome to the channel appreciate you smashing the play button and taking the time to spend this time with me to check out what it is that I do and I bring that footage to you so stay tuned be right back okay everyone here we are back that is the machine that I'm speaking of and that machine right there has the ability of being able to not only lift product, but it can also, it has hydraulics on it, which means it can extend outward and reach in to grab something. So, get out of the sunlight. I like filming. All the odd and peculiar stuff. Crazy. Yeah. Anything that seemed a little off, I'm going to put it on film. <laughs> Are they narrow enough? Uh, oh, yeah, that was over there. I'll push them in. Would it reach enough? Yeah, okay. All right. I don't Here we go. Enough, but that's what I'm saying. I wonder if we got to strap it. You might have to. You may have to strap it. That thing looks pretty heavy. Even though it's only the total load is only about 4,800 pounds, you're still looking at. That's, that's what I said. Yeah. Noticing the legs on that side and that yeah. big bounce on that yes, side, if I tilt it back, it might be okay. You got a strap to the side that you think? Huh? Yeah, we got to cut those too. I'll That's strapped to the floor, yeah. yeah. I got a knife though. I'll tell you what, let me go ahead and put these forks down, Rick, and I'll run down to the trailer and get the strap. I'll go do that now. You can go ahead? All right, perfect. Thank you. I got some, um, I got a razor blade thing that can cut those straps. Yeah, we'll take care of your Okay. So Dimitri said that you go there. We're going to pause for a minute. All righty. We are back. We're going to see what happens. Probably have to use some straps. I can't see if I had the hole on the other side. Oh, uh, okay. uh, you need to come this way a little bit. Back up a little more. Back up. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Now come.
somebody up there with the eyes and tell you what to do, you're good. Yeah. That does help out a whole lot. Yeah. Not all of them, but the, the unique, different stuff. That strap should help a whole lot, though. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that too. You never know. where the sunlight is not. Looks like he has it off the ground. And it looks like it's smooth sailing. That strap is gonna keep it connected to the forklift where it don't tilt forward. It weighs about 2,400 pounds. If the forks was longer. He says yours. <laughs> there we go. The first one is off. And now we're going to come back to watch him stay tuned. And he's going to grab the second one, which is a little bit more challenging because it's further inside the container. That one, my dad, was easy to get to because it was on the end. But that boom has the ability to shoot outward. So it should be the same type of situation. Just him extension, extending the boom on the forklift. So stay tuned, be right back. We've already reached in there and grabbed that second one. And now we're pulling that second one right on out of there. Already strapped down. Should be easy peasy from here on out. Sorry about that little glitch in the video. I was talking to fitness talk. Nutrition, but here we go. And that's what that thing looks like. It's gonna be a wet and a dry tank for the compressors that they're gonna be using to make these batteries. And that's what these are. Don't forget. Don't forget to take those. 
Ja. Okay, everyone, we are done. We are unloaded. Truck Driver Lifestyles. We are finishing the video. Thanks for hitting the channel, hit, hitting that play button. If you like the video, please subscribe. If you also like the video, hit the like button. Don't forget to comment. Because when I hit 50 subscribers, I will be giving away a $25 gift card. So stand by for that, because as soon as I hit, I will be videotaping me pulling that name. So hit that subscribe button. Check me out. More videos coming. I got more footage already uploaded. And I just got to get everything right and put it on here. But Truck Driver Lifestyle, signing out till next time. Peace.